Y'all, welcome back. Another hero's journey. This one we're doing, going a little different here. So, we are experimenting with the A7S 3 handheld, the Tamron 17 to 28, active, stable, is on. So right now I'm literally just holding the camera. We have 2.8 f-stop, 150 shutter, 4K, 23.98, um, and we have auto exposure just so I don't have to fiddle too much in an ND filter. But y'all, so the point here is, I just want to see how good this active stabilization is. Just like hand holding and not even really caring. Like I don't even have a little monopod. Um, got nothing. Just hand holding. So give me a sec here. We're gonna walk through this highly. I never get actually. Yeah. So here we go. We're continuing on. Um, it's in kind of windy up here. We're gonna see how this goes. Oh, I didn't know it was this windy. Wow. Oh crap. This might put a damper in this whole operation. Because my other uh, maneuver I'm gonna try, y'all, is I'm going to try to change my lens without stopping recording. So, because I'm on a wide angle, we're gonna go do a quick little surf check. Little surf check. It just rained a crap load. So unfortunately, even if the waves were going off, I am abstaining because the waters are probably polluted with the vid and it's common practice in Los Angeles and other beaches too in California to avoid surfing. Am I blown out right here? Maybe a little. I have it on auto ISO or oh, whatever. We're just seeing how the auto is going to work with this. Um, you got to avoid surfing for a little bit afterwards. Sorry if I'm bumpy y'all again. I'm just practicing how this is going to be if I'm not really caring too much. And surprisingly, I'm looking at it. It's looking surprisingly good. I think I'm a little blown out, but it's saying no. All right. Um, it is funny, you know, I'm like walking around just filming myself. It's like, oh, this guy's... This guy's ego is huge. Yeah, guys, hope everyone's holidays are going well. It is uh, New Year's Eve Eve. Yeah, we're going to do a wave check. And we're going to do an experiment of a lens switch while the camera is still recording. So that's going to be fun. I don't want to toot my horn, but this could be very smooth for just not even monitoring my walk. Wow, it's kind of popping out here. I have to mask on, mask off while I'm walking through some of these crowds. Um, yeah, see, I thought I'm very bright. I cover my face, that happens. Oh no, we're gonna, I have an ND filter on, like I said, I think I said that. Um, yeah, I probably should shoot some, some cool B-roll too. But I just want this to be one take. I want this to be one take. I don't want to do any editing. Just drop on the computer and then drop it in the old social media lands. I am looking kind of bright, but hey, this is, we're going for it. It's a test. Sony ISO, the new, new ISO. Can you handle this? Looks like it's handled pretty well. And that little eye tracker is just chilling on my eye. Oh yeah, wow, lovely. A lot of action up here. All right, also here we go. We are doing a little wave check. The sun's shining right at us. I'm gonna get a little hidden behind this tree. There we go, look at that. So yeah, y'all. Um, all right, I'm going to attempt to change the lens now. And let me just give you a quick look. How it's looking out there. So you can't see. You can't see none of that, can you? You can't see that. I'll 
lights are very bright. But let me know a quick, uh, quick lens swap why, while we are recording. So let's see how this goes. All so hang with me. All right, we are filming this way. I'm getting the lens out of my pocket. Let's see, maybe I'll do this. This is where I should have bought some kind of blanket or something. Right, let's see here. All right, um, just give me a sec, y'all. I'm gonna let it keep recording while I get this thing primed and ready. All right, take this quick. This quick here. All right, this is coming off. All right, y'all. I'm bummed because it actually stopped recording. That was not very cool, Sony. I thought you were gonna be able to pull that one off. So, um, fortunately, my whole plan backfired. But let's get a look at these this waves over here. Let's see here. Um. Give me a sec here, y'all. Let, let me get a little closer. Get a little closer. A little closer here. All right, let's see here. We got it here. We got. We got here. It's super blown out. Um, bring this f stop down some. I don't know why the, uh, the ISO can't go down anymore. Okay, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Alright, y'all, we're just checking it out here. There's a little something. There's a little something out there. There's a little something. Um, let me bring this F stop a little more. Wow, it's. See, I heard a scoping this out. Sorry, y'all, for the shaky, uh, shakiness. So as you can see, there's there's a little little something. This is Venice breakwater. I think the tide. I gotta double check, but usually breaks not like breaking it right there because the tides are probably not allowing it. So yeah, there, there's a little something out there. But, um, I'm not going to partake. Yeah. There's, a. Um, I'm probably super dark now. I don't care. A little sum out there, guys. I'm not going to partake for now. So let's, uh, let's get these settings back to how we want them. All right. Now I think we're gonna go back to the old school, uh, old school Tamron 28 to 75. So I shouldn't be vlogging on this. I'm really tight. But you know what? I don't want to change the lens again. And then I have to do more editing. And this is kind of cool. As long as I hold it, we'll do another test here. This is gonna be just the. Uh, I'm being crazy with it. See how this goes. It's going surprisingly well. It's locked on my eye decently. Um, yeah, it's pretty locked on. So, let's keep walking here. Yeah, I just want to do a quick check. It's, uh, like I said, there's, oh, there's more coming now. Yeah, maybe I should have checked for a little longer. <laughs> well, we, we got a quick glance on it. We got a quick glance. Um, yeah, I just want to get back just so I can hit upload, you know, get this hero's journey out sooner than later. Might come back and do a little bit of a photography just to keep testing this new bad boy this is the only third day i think i've had this camera and i've already gotten some comments i mean this thing is just ridiculous and i am shooting in the it's the h.265 so it's like a little different whereas it's not like perfectly uh it's not h264 which has kind of been the standard for a long time they kind of change it to 8265, but a lot of computers, even like the newest ones, have trouble editing the uh, the footage. 
because it's like um, the H.265 is just like a different compression and the computers just don't know what's going on. So, but with the Sony and with even Panasonic and Fuji did with their newer, uh, their newer ones is they made 420 10-bit as opposed to 422. And this actually helps the computers process the clips easier. So it doesn't end up being just like a total shutdown of the computer. Like you can edit, like I haven't, actually this will be the first time I'm gonna edit, you know, just throw these in Final Cut to see how these are gonna, how these are gonna cut and move on the timeline, et cetera. I mean, these are only two clips back to back, but we'll see, you know, we'll see how this kind of moves in Final Cut. I might try to play it, maybe even add some effects, kind of see the deal, but. Um, all right, y'all, that's about it though. So I wanna do a quick little wave check with you. I wanted to, I wish I kept recording. That'd have been cool to kind of see the lens come off and go on, but instead it lamely shut off. And then I had to like hit record again. And it's like, come on, dude. Now I gotta hit the edit lab. It's like a beautiful day out here. It's beautiful. I want to go sit inside, but all right, y'all. I'm going to hit that, get to it. Have a good one. Happy New Year, almost. Peace.